Hello everybody, it's Brian with you from the Game Common, and we're playing some more Civ 6. I promise this is going to be the last episode I record today. Ugh, I need I need to stop playing this game. I'm addicted. Like, I seriously might make my own uh, playthrough off camera, just so I can keep playing the game without having to worry about commentary. Because the interesting thing with commentary is when you get really, really tired sometimes, I mean, obviously it's kind of hard to talk. Um, even now, I have to kind of talk a little slower and think a little bit more about what I'm going to say. But we're still having a lot of fun, and I hope you guys are enjoying the series, because I am really liking this game. It's fun. It looks really, really good. Like, like, I know the graphics are a little more kiddie, but I think they came out really well. Also, holy crap, look at her swordmen. They look badass. That's sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. How are our archers? Our archers look standard. I don't notice, any, notice anything special there. Our horses, yeah, they have a little bit of a Chinese flavor to them. But eh, it's fine. Not nothing. Not nothing. Nothing too spectacular, I guess. So we're going to move this way in case there's barbarian encampments. Mostly also as well to protect from anyone else trying to plant a city. Because screw you guys, this is my city. I want over here. Um, Archer, come on over. Come on over. I, I don't know. There was a song that goes like, come on over. And I don't know what it, how it goes. But uh, we're going to keep going this way, I think. Cliff walls, I don't get how that works. I suppose this right here, if there was a city, I could come up, I guess? Or I guess they can enter through here? Like they could disembark from that direction, I guess? I don't know. Be intrigued to see how that works. We're gonna keep exploring with our galley, our one ship, the one ship to rule them all. <laughs> I, I, yeah. The later it gets at night, the more crazy I get. Like, I'm going to say like a lot, apparently, but when I was younger, I noticed that the later it got, the more sarcastic I would become. So if you notice me being really sarcastic in a lot of these videos, just know it's probably because it's getting late here. Um, we'll move me into the city because that's going to allow me to jump over quickly next turn. Probably should have done that with you, but eh, we're whatever. We're okay. It's not like we're fighting a war right now. Um, what do you, what do you need? You actually have plenty of housing, so I'm not worried about that. We did... I think we're going for a harbor. God, that harbor takes forever, but I really need the harbor. I want the lighthouse. Uh, we could do a monument, but eh. I have so much money, I can just buy tiles. Like, I'm making 23 a turn on turn 93. Come on, that's ridiculous. I guess we're just going to bite the bullet and go harbor. Uh, we get plus one because it's adjacent to fish, so sounds great. Question... This one would just be plus one, I think, because it's adjacent to the uh, crab. Let me double check on that. Make sure that it's not worth buying. So, harbor. It gets plus one gold from every two adjacent districts, plus one from each adjacent coastal resource. So, this counts as one district. If we build a district here, that's going to count as two districts. If we put it here, we're only going to have one district because I'm not going to replace that. So, yeah, our best bet's going to be to put it right here. And we'll want to build another district there. Probably a, a commercial, uh, not a commercial one. The industrial zone. So, what were we doing? Crap. What were we just? Construction. Don't, don't change anything. <laughs> we're fine. Three turns away from... Political philosophy, we have still only met one city-state, which is a little on the depressing side. We have two, and we're about to get an envoy in nine turns. So, all right, cool. I keep forgetting to level you up. Whoops. Next turn. Let's just level him up while we're thinking about it. And hey, we can now do you. All right, cool, spread religion. So it was, we're now one to their two. Good to know. I'm gonna move you here. And then we're just going to take a break. Unit needs orders. Let's check out this forest. Let's check out this forest. Oh, and this is the edge. Can I disembark? No, I still can't disembark. So, crap. This is really interesting. Like, I like the bridge. They seem very civilized. <laughs> civilized. Huh. So, I guess we're going to come back this way. I may try coming down here, but more likely I'm going to come this way. I'm just trying to get a picture of my neighbors right now. Mm, next turn. What the heck was that? Okay. 
So... Can I? Eureka. Work on the water mill has taught your workers much about construction. Your knowledge of construction has advanced. Is that what we're working on? Nice. And hey, we got games and recreation. Sweet. Create with the heart. Build with the mind. Nice. So, oh, this was the water mill one. Yeah, okay. We might have been, we might have wasted a turn on that, but I think we're still okay. Can I do machinery? No, I still need to do engineering. I can do either of these. I can do apprenticeship, which will give us the industrial zone. Build ancient walls. I do feel like we're going to build walls. So let's do the mines. Let's get the workshop in the industrial zone. Probably not going to do that. I may or may not do that. Plus one trader out capacity. Grants a trader unit. Must be built on the coast adjacent to land and a harbor district. So I need a harbor for this. Plus three gold. So the only way for that to happen is for me to actually construct a harbor. We could do some walls, knock that out. The problem is, it's not worth it, because I only have a certain number of uh, areas I can build right now. And we can build how many? A commercial hub, plus one. Nice. Where is, it's gotta be here somewhere. One of two districts. Okay, so as you grow, you can get more districts. I think it's like 3, 7, and 13 or something like that. So we really do want something that can build. Um, or grow. We want to grow our cities, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Uh, let's think. We were going to build... We were going to build the industrial zone right here. We're still seven turns away from that. So do we go for the Hanging Gardens? If we build the Industrial Zone there, we'll want probably to put this here because there's not going to be anything here. There's no bonus for being adjacent to anything, correct? Plus four faith. Must be adjacent. There's no bonus. I don't know any of these get uh, a bonus for being next to... We could go build the walls, or the granary, or the monument. Now, the granary would give us a little more food, which is going to grow our town quicker, because we are growing a hair slow right now. But I am playing the Wonder Game. Well, here's the other option. We're going to switch governments in two turns, and that's going to speed this up. Screw it. Let's do it. <laughs> I need more builders, too. But, man, all my cities are growing a little slow, so I think that would be nice. I, I think that's going to be a bonus for us. Ooh, zone of control. Or we could get plus 10 combat strength when defending versus city attacks. Which would be good with what he was doing on me. Plus one additional attack is great. Yeah, uh, I'm going to do emplacement. And we need to get him a little more XP. Oof. He's going to be he's gonna be baller next turn. Okay, so question. Interesting. So... You can actually do religious combat in this game where you can like send missionaries to fight missionaries and you'll see that they'll actually do damage to each other. And what's funny is if I end up killing his missionary, that's going to give a bonus to communism where it's going to subtract the bonus to um, Catholicism, 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 something like that. So let's go ahead and use this plus 200 communism. And what's this looking like now? I mean, this is going up, but it's still the exact same. So, I don't know if speeding this up does anything at this point. Can I actually, like, check the screen somewhere? Does it talk about religion? Plus one common citizen. We get plus one culture from all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you know, I need my worker to come repair this. Also, too, I'm going to move you over here and speed this up. I probably need to buy a worker. We're probably going to buy a worker here at some point. You, sir, let's go explore this way. Once again, I'm looking for borders. Move you here. I... I suppose we're going to move you over here. Actually, you know what? I'm going to move you right here. So you can be kind of in the middle. I need to build a road. 
Actually, I need a lot of roads. I need my trader out to freaking finish. Or my harbor to freaking finish. 31 turns. Oh, my God. Nine turns. Ah. You didn't need orders. Um, we're going to move you right here for now. Now, I think because I am not in my zone, I don't know I'm going to get a bonus. We're going to come move him right here. So, okay, let's let's see if we can look this up. Religious combat. Wars of religion. Nope. Religion? Founding new religion? Religion units and pressure? Inquisitors are special units that must be unlocked. You only need to use this action once. You can start Inquisition. It never ends. You can then purchase Inquisitors. Inquisitors are not good at spreading religion, but remove other religions. They also may engage in theological combat. Okay. Missionaries in any city and have the ability to spread religion. So my thoughts are maybe the missionaries can't attack each other. It's only an Inquisitor or something like that. I don't know. We'll have to see. Uh, I am going to come pre spread... Maybe I'll spread a Rio de Janeiro. That's going to be their religious holy site. It's a Catholic holy site. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you can see the, the faith right here. The shrine and everything. Ah, I may want to go Germany, though, just to make Germany like me more. I don't know. Let's we'll see. You, sir. Let's keep exploring. I don't want to walk him into, like, a barbarian or anything like that. So, let's kind of go this way. And this encampment that was over here is actually gone. You know what I need? I need the settler. Seven turns. Man, 19 turns. How much does a settler cost? 480? Is a settler more important right now than my hanging gardens? Probably. As cool as this would be. But I can knock this out so quick. And then we can switch over. Yeah, because in two turns, we're going to switch over, I think, to the settler. Yeah, no, we're going to keep We're going to keep doing it. I keep trying to talk myself out of it, dang it. But no, we will be strong. I will survive. And you have a promotion. Ooh, okay, good to know. Next turn. That's going to mean I don't really have to um, uh, heal him at all. Mm. Sorry, I'm drinking my beer. Who needs orders? My swordsman. Oh, all right. Go this way. We'll probably just leave you, like, there. Missionary. I can't attack. I guess we're just going to skip my turn and see what happens. And you are over there. So let's go bring you back over this direction. Oh, we have open borders. Borders. We have open borders. So come over here. Let's come check out this guy. Next turn. I want to see what he does. Oh, God, he's spamming missionaries in my direction. I don't seem to be able to attack him. Crap! Die, you freaking bastards. Uh, all right, well, come over here. I don't think this is going to change, so unit needs orders. Wait, wait, is it my turn now? Cool, promotion. Uh, plus 10 combat strength versus fortified defender, plus 7 combat strength when defending versus ranged attack. Let's do against fortified defender. And that puts you at full HP. Um, you, let's go bring you over here. I'm going to leave you actually right there, I think. Let's bring you on the mountain and we'll go this way. You're probably fine right here, so let's just leave you for the time being. If he tries anything funny, I'll be able to, actually, you know what? Let's move him over here. I'm going to put him on this hill and he'll guard my base from over there if we ever get attacked. Um, and this is my missionary, which I thought I told you to come over here. I'm so glad we got a horsey. That's so wonderful. So we're going to get a water mill, which is going to give us plus one food on this wheat. This is just regular food. Now, the only problem is this religious site. It's actually uninviting. Huh. I wonder if it's a religious site for... Can I faith purchase? No, I can purchase missionaries here. Are they going to be mine? May convert citizens, may not initiate combat, but can defend. Okay, there we go. 
No, this isn't mine because you can purchase the Watt. Yeah, this is Catholicism. Yeah, because the city's Catholic. That sucks. Do I need to keep putting my missionary here? You know what? I think I need to keep putting my missionary there. We're just going to fortify you. Let's keep moving you. Actually, let's take you up here. Nope, nothing there. All right, next turn. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep throwing my missionary at these guys. Uh, unit needs to turn. Ooh, okay. So, we're at nine turns. Speed it up. That took off one turn. That's kind of disappointing. <laughs> if I'm going to be honest, that was, that was a little disappointing. Freaking Brazil. Can I tell them to stop, like, sending their missionaries towards me? Used to formally state your unhappiness. If I click this, does that, like, do it automatically? Uh, sir, I want you to like me. What would make you like me? I'll give you my holy grail. <laughs> I don't actually care. Although I need it for my tourism. Opportunity has arrived for a change into a new and more powerful system of government. Let us strengthen our identity and enact more policies to govern our people. Politics is the Sounds art good. of the possible, the attainable, the art of the next best. With your people enthused to try political philosophy, government and social policy changes are free. Oh, gotcha. Okay, so first things first, let's go ahead and change our government. And we want to do autocrat, autocrat, autocracy, autocracy. Pfft, Sorry, it's late. Um, production, we want to do settlers. Wait, wait a second. Do we need to buy any more tiles while it's still my turn? I do need to buy these tiles, but I don't have anyone close to me. Um, because I'm going to finish this up. Yeah, no, I think we're okay right now. So, change policies. So, settlers, please. We now can do green ones. Um, first envoy is two, but we don't have any envoys. Plus two influence points per turn. Great scientist, great general. A great scientist would probably be good. And we're actually, I think, getting close to a great scientist. I don't know. We could also do one of these other ones. We could do production towards builders. But that doesn't really help me right now. I don't care about the money so much. Um, oh. We have plus 10% bonus on wonder production. We could do another 15%? That might be really interesting. And here, I don't think it really matters. Production towards classical melee range. Heavy light cavalry. I guess let's do naval. Because I wouldn't mind some more naval. So, this should significantly be reduced. Six turns. Choose civic. Open civic tree. Um, probably drama. Found a religion. Temple might not be bad. Let's see. Theater square is going to be good. Amphitheater will be good. Arena, coliseum, entertainment. So, this is another district. I have too many districts right now. Research the construction technology. How have I not researched the construction technology? Construction. Construction. You know what this needs? There. <laughs> I was like, it needs a search. Construct. Research the construction technology. Huh? Construction. That makes no sense. Oh, it's already boosted. Okay, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Ignore me, guys. <sighs> Plus one in amenity from entertainment. Coliseum is a wonder. Entertainment complex. It's a district to keep near people by increasing amenities. And this is a district for cultural. I think we might actually... I take this back. Let's actually come here so we can do the Coliseum. I changed my mind. 
I want the Coliseum. Because this should be done here sooner rather than later. You guys, I'm just going to bring you over here. I think that's going to be okay. Uh, was this my one worker? Boom. Down to four turns. So we're getting really close to knocking that one out. Uh, we're going to bring you up here. Um, You know what we're going to do? I'm going to actually take you over here. Because any sort of our, a fog of war can actually spawn barbarians. So we kind of want to be a little bit careful. That's kind of why I'm moving my guys over here. Just so we can make sure that no barbarians are here. And that they don't spawn. Who needs housing? Need more housing. Okay. Well, the water mill is going to give us more housing. I'm pretty sure. I'm almost certain, right? I wish it told you, actually, on that freaking screen. No, it doesn't give us housing. Well, that sucks. It's giving me more production, though. Uh, okay, whatever. Unit needs orders. We're coming down here. And uh, we finally found the edge of the map. And can we pass through Carthage? Are we allowed to pass through you? I don't know. I don't remember. I don't think we can. I have no idea. <laughs> uh, let's just move you back. You're fine. Next turn. Ah, we gotta wrap this episode up again. Freaking mission- Oh, this is my missionary. Spread. Ooh, okay, so now we're two and two. All right, so I think that's worth it. Although the Catholicism is actually going up now. And that's bad. Let's keep going. Get the freaking hell away from my city, you little punks. Uh, Germany has progressed the classical era to the medieval. So we're a little behind right now. But that's okay. Um, boom. Score. So no items are available to purchase, because right now, religiously, it's what? Even? Is what it seems like? Religion? I can't actually see. Oh, it's here. Ah. Two Catholic, two common. So, cool. So I may want to go ahead and purchase another guy. Here's the other question. We're making quite a bit. Um, great people. Some of these are only $750. you are going up quite a bit. Yeah, we're actually zero on all of these, which is kind of depressing. So I wonder if I should just save for the 750 and buy some of these. Like a great scientist would be wonderful. At 25 a turn is going to be... We need to get to uh, 6, 7, 8, 900. Four turns, 9, 18, 27, 36 turns. Oi, that's going to be a little bit. Missionary? Yeah, but here's the other thing. The more people we have, the more religion we get. Ah, I don't know. We'll figure that out next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, drop a like. Go ahead and comment. Let me know what you guys think. Any suggestions you guys may have. And most of all, join the comments. Show your support. Hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.